Good morning guys and girls, so it is Sunday the 17th of July and it has just gone 6am as you can see up there. Now, I'm usually not up this early on a Sunday unless I'm going on holiday. Unfortunately, I'm not going on holiday. Um, but in fact, it is Charlotte's powerlifting meet today. So, we are up nice and early because we've got to head down to Dover, which is about an hour and a half away. Um, so, just getting up nice and early, getting everything prepared. Um, but we're going to see if Charlotte is weighing in the right amount. So, <laughs> she's hopefully competing in the 57 kilo class. Um, she was 57.8 kilos last night before we went to bed. So, fingers crossed she is down a little bit and she will be down to 57 uh, by the time we get there, which would be about 9 o'clock this morning. Yeah, buddy! <laughs> And I weighed in at 171.4. So this was kind of last week. I've, To be fair, I just write it somewhere on it. But this was, uh, I think this was Sunday last week. So Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Weird setup, but that is what I weighed in. Um, 171.4, so last week I was 171.8. And last Monday I was 174.8. So it's my refeed day today. Uh, and this is just kind of how my weight has fluctuated. So I was, you know, I kind of went up and then I come down, 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 and then I've gone up again. And that's kind of the trend I like, I have seen so far. So basically what tends to happen is I'll have my refeed day. So it is actually my refeed day today. I will be up tomorrow and then I will slowly come down towards the end of the week. And usually either Wednesday, Thursday or Friday, I will hit a new low. And then Saturday and Sunday, I'll probably go up again in weight and then the cycle returns. But um, like I usually say to my clients, like don't worry about weight fluctuations. And this is to kind of a perfect example. Why is because I have them as well. Uh, but I know that I'm supposed to usually hit a new low on a Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. And if I don't hit a new low Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, then it usually means that I need to make a change. But all the other days, I just kind of, I just write the number down. I'm just simply writing the number down, looking at trends and not really worrying about it, knowing full well that, you know, even though on a Saturday and Sunday, I've actually been dieting for longer than Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, when I normally hit my new low, it doesn't really matter because I, I've seen the trend that Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, I hit a new low, so. That is just the way it is, and it's all about knowing yourself and learning yourself and learning the process and all that stuff. So, uh, yeah, anyway, gonna get ready now. It's quarter past six. We wanna be left by about seven, half seven to get there for about eight o'clock. Wayne's up between eight and 9.30. So, next time you'll see me, I will probably be getting everything in the car, getting ready to hit the road. Okay, so we got the supplies on deck. So we got some grub, we got some pre-workout, plenty of fluids as well. Got the camera bag full of lenses, ready to take some cool pictures and cool videos and stuff. But Charlotte has just forgot the wrist wrap, so she's gone back in to get the wrist wraps. But we're gonna head down now. It is almost half past seven. We've got to be there by half nine. It takes about an hour and a half to get there, so we should be there in plenty of time, ready for Charlotte to weigh in. So it's almost 10 a.m. now, we're about to start. And Charlotte, unfortunately, weighed in at 56.7. Uh, so yeah, well in, well within the weight class of 57 kilos. There's only one girl in her category and she's not going on until later on. We're not quite sure yet. Right, so current situation of events is that Charlotte is in the last group. So they have A, B, C, D, E and F group. She is in the F group and they're doing two groups at a time. So they're basically doing squat bench and deadlift then all the awards ceremony and then on to the next couple of groups so you have a's and b's going now then d's and e's and or c's and d's and then e's and f's now we've been here for about an hour and the first two groups have only just finished the squat so they've got the bench and the deadlift then the awards 
and then they've got another two groups and then the awards and then another two groups. So we're going to be here for a long, long time. Now, that's not really an issue. And I think for Charlotte, it's a really, really good thing because it just means that she's going to be a bit more confident with uh, getting some fluids in, getting plenty of food in and just being a lot more confident. We had to do like a little bit of a water cut. So she's a little bit dehydrated this morning. And if she lifted first, it may have been an issue, but I think she's going to be fine. However, having said that, being a busy man that I am, I don't really want to sit there and watch people lifting all the time. Um... <laughs> You know, just doing squat bench and dead. I do enough of it myself. So basically, I'm going to head out now to a Costa just quickly just to uh, download a few files on my laptop so that I can basically work while I'm kind of watching and, and waiting for Charlotte. And then as soon as Charlotte's on, I'm going to be coaching her and stuff like that. But uh, I've got always got programming to do or content to write and just loads of bits and pieces. So I'm going to go and do that. So I'm going to go grab some Wi-Fi because I can't get data here because we're in the middle of nowhere and grab a couple of coffees as well. So I will see you guys in a sec. Right, so the first round of lifters are done and it is one o'clock. So they started lifting at 10. There is another round of lifters to go, so they're going to do the award ceremony in a second and then get onto the senior men. And I think there's more in that than there was in this last uh, round of people. So we're thinking that we're probably not going to start lifting. I say we, Charlotte, I'm not lifting anything. <laughs> not lifting a finger. I'm lifting up my lunch, that's about it. Um, <laughs> So that's probably not going to start until maybe four, half four, if we're lucky. So basking in the sun, it's a lovely, lovely day. And I was kind of worried that we'd have to be inside all day. But no, we're going to sit outside probably for at least an hour or so, I imagine, and eat some lunch. I've got some honey mustard chicken that I made yesterday with some boodles and some tomatoes. So I'm going to enjoy this, bask in the sun, and probably catch up with you when Charlotte finally starts lifting. Nah, picture me rolling, tipping my chauffeur. Niggas look jealous, you gotta control it. Reaching my quota, mixing my soda. Feeling connected to God, trying to get closer. Stepping on roaches, me and my loasters. Just trying to get over, try not to get swallowed by locusts. Trying to stay focused, kinda like Moses. Like somebody chose us, sweat on my shoulder. I feel these emotions, but still I keep going. I've been to a poet, I've been through the motions, I'm feeling heroic, but life is a dice game, and I dare you to blow it, you might get a strike man, but that ain't gonna pay for the strollers, it's never enough to console her, tell her your daddy is soldier, she needs you right now in this moment, I dead on your back push your roses, to me I'm just carving the scotia, and fine tuning my approaches, doubling back as an owner, the moment of truth is the bonus, call them promoters. Hey. Right, so we are all done at the meet. It has just gone 25 past seven. So a very, very long, long day. Um, so Charlotte managed a 90 kilo squat, a 42.5 kilo bench, and a 120 kilo deadlift, which is very, very happy with. Um, but my thoughts on it were, it's it just really highlights how different uh, like an actual meet is compared to being in the gym. Like you can't, warm up as much as you want to necessarily or you're not sure when to warm up you can't you don't have the luxury of choosing when to lift 
you're kind of told when to lift. Right, it's your turn now. Right, you don't know whether you're going to have three minutes rest or ten minutes rest between attempts. And we also had to wait around for the day and, and everything as well. So very, very difficult, but very happy and very proud of what Charlotte did today. Charlotte. Okay, so we are back from the powerlifting meet. Uh, got back about half past nine. It is now half past ten. We just spent some time kind of clearing, clearing up the flat and making it good because we made loads of mess yesterday, cooking and stuff. I say we, it's pretty much just me. Uh, and whilst I was kind of clearing up the flat and stuff and sorting stuff out for tomorrow, Charlotte made a, I was gonna say a breakfast pizza, but it's a dessert pizza. Um, basically left with loads and loads of carbs today. It's my refeed day today because I was out most of the day. I was eating like quite regularly, but it was like low calorie stuff, like fiber one bars, popcorn and stuff, and then realized I had about a thousand calories left to eat. So we are going to share this pizza awesomeness. So what do we have, babe? So we've got our classic yogurt and self-raising flour pizza base, which with my meat brain, I made with plain flour. So I had to make it again. So do that. Um, and we've topped it with muscle mousse, um, some granola, banana, white chocolate cookie, carb killer, Snickers bar. Uh, protein bar, Snickers protein yeah, bar. Yeah, Snickers protein bar, sorry. Um, did I say banana? <laughs> and chop, chop. Oh, just lots and lots and lots and lots of goodies. And um, yeah, just loads of stuff. So gonna enjoy this and then hit the hay because I have a long, busy day tomorrow of check-in. So, as always, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, make sure you give Charlotte a thumbs up as well for today. <laughs> um, but give the video a thumbs up if you like the video. Hopefully you like the kind of cinematic stuff of the powerlifting meet. And yeah, subscribe to my YouTube if you haven't already, and like my Facebook, and just like all my shit. Like it all.